r slash ask reddit sign language users of reddit what is a common sign you see people do without being aware they are doing it a colleague of mine once told me a story about how he was singing twinkle twinkle little star for a group of children when he noticed a lady at the back of the room stifling a laugh she approached him afterwards to apologize and explain that his hand symbol for star was pretty much sign language for vagina so couldn't help her reaction he altered the delivery of the song for future audiences. There was a fad a few years ago where people did peace signs on their foreheads in selfies. That means stupid in ASL. Also frequent to see people say vagina, lesbian or period. Occasionally hearing people mess up trying to sign thank you to me and accidentally say duck you. My calc teacher is guilty of the thank you slash duck you mix up. BSL user here. You should know that whenever you do a double-handed finger gun, you're dangerously close to saying anal sex. From now on my standard greeting will be a double-handed finger gun. Zoop. It would be really funny to get a video of someone who gestures a lot when they give speeches and do subtitles as if you're interpreting their gestures with the with the nearest equivalent ASL signs. Like an ASL version of bad lip reading on YouTube. They watched in confusion. One deaf, and one not the president spoke and he gestured a lot. I don't understand him. Signed one with a sigh, the other responded. Dut, and neither do I. Worked security in a class A office building with a guy who had a deaf daughter. Every once in a while he would slip signs in as he was talking. Had a lady file a complaint against him for blowing her a kiss. He had slipped into signing and said thank you. Edit. Ro. Went for a walk and this took off. So. For context. This was a large office building owned by a national bank who occupied about 40% of the space. The lady was an employee of said bank. We were employees of a security company contracted by the building managers and people generally look down upon those working in security. Hence the complaint as for what happened with it. The property people let my boss do an investigation without having a knee-jerk reaction. They were pretty cool that way. My co-worker explained what happened and that was that. It also helped that there were two deaf workers in the ladies' own department that knew that my guy could sign. My co-worker seemed amused by the whole situation. My old neighbor was a speech therapist so she often slipped sign into conversation. What was odd to me is that she didn't notice when people signed back. My youngest son was functionally deaf until after ear surgery and would often sign and it just slipped by her. My good daughter's son signed for nearly 4 years before he decided to talk. No physical reason he was just more comfortable with it. And again she never noticed. Seemed so odd. Edit. I'm leaving it lol. My god daughters are the only daughters I have and they are both good so it works lol. That's what happens when you reply without reading it back. I see lesbian signed a lot without being aware. It's the first finger and thumb in the shape of an L placed on the chin. People do this when pondering something. Edit. Wow quite the response. Some of your replies are funny too like how in Filipino it's handsome. And for those the asked no deaf people don't even tend to notice unless someone does it excessively. Have fun watching for it now. What about a finger and thumb in the shape of an L on her forehead? And they don't stop coming. Vagina. It always makes me giggle a bit. This happens a lot in Oregon. The University of Oregon sports fans have a lot of spirit. And they like to put their hands together in an O and cheer. Unfortunately, many of them put their hands together in the wrong way and you have half a stadium signing vagina and shouting an extended O in excitement. How many times I've seen guys unknowingly sign lesbian in ASL when flirting with girls in real life and in the movies. Thinking face. This sign. Edit. To add to this. I. Regrettably. Taught the signs lesbian. Gay. Comma lit. White trash. And weird in ASL to some of my hearing friends because they ask me and they use it constantly to insult each other discreetly. Mind you. I taught them other more useful signs. But those 5 signs are the only ones they remember. And 95% of them are straight dudes. It's still funny though. My gay brother used to do this in pictures and someone pointed out one day what it meant. He only did it more after that and when he was talking about his lesbian friends would do the sign when talking about her sexuality. Every time you make a thumbs up, you're saying the number 10. Every time you do the okay sign, you're saying the number 9. Every time you cross your fingers, it's the letter R. Edit. Yes I'm talking about ASL. 
Sorry for any confusion. Nah, when I do the OK sign I'm saying the letter F. The sign for go. My man. I briefly took a sign language class in college. On day 1, the teacher assigned all of us name signs related to the first letter of our first names. My first name starts with C, and she assigned me a name sign with a C shape signed on my left chest, which I later learned is the actual sign in my area for citation. The chest position relates to the position of a police officer's badge, I guess. I was mostly amused. If this is ASL. It also means police officer. That's a fairly common sign name for people who start with C though. Anytime you've held up your index finger and your middle finger to indicate 2, then corrected yourself and held up your ring finger to indicate 3, you've unintentionally advertised for Volkswagen. The sign for the number 6, when you are trying to indicate 3 by holding 3 fingers up with the pointer, middle and ring finger, you are saying 6 in sign language. The number 3 is pointer, middle and thumb. I once had a student that didn't even use the ASL 6. Her version of 3 was actually equivalent to ASL 7. It was so weird. Actually that's the shocker. Pro tip. Saying sign language is like saying spoken language. There are dozens of different sign languages. The most common in the United States being ASL. Even the British sign language is different. The alphabet even. American Sign Language is more closely related to French Sign Language because of those two Frenchmen coming off the boat with intentions to spread sign language. My history is rusty. The language is based on a wealthy American family who sent a tutor to Britain to learn BSL and bring it back to teach their deaf daughter. The British Sign Schools refused to help a foreigner. The tutor was then sent to France where a French Sign School happily taught him FSL. He took it back to America and developed the language as a cross between Rural American Signs and FSL. That was the basis for today's ASL. ASL. Every time people clap they're unintentionally signing school. Edit. To add of another one I thought of, the I'm going to take your nose game you play with kids, becomes toilet so. Or paper. Hamburgers are a rarity unless the user is being overly dramatic. Edit. Or becomes Tuesday if you give the tea a swirl. Knuckles facing towards your face. It's also Tuesday today. Clutching. I just started learning sign language. I don't know anything particularly funny. But I thought they were interesting to find out. The little hand jiggle that people do to say so so kinda means the same thing in sign. When you snap your fingers or pat your leg to call your dog, you're saying dog. Blowing a kiss is very similar to thank you. Also, a lot of people talk with their hands and end up sort of opening their hands palm up in front of them. Kind of like saying wah, literally means what in sign. Part of me wonders if we adopted those gestures from sign or if sign adopted them from fidgety people. Anyone know the history of the development of sign who can answer that? If your sign language teacher didn't tell you that those signs were adopted from those gestures then you should tell them to include that in the curriculum. My teacher always tells us how the sign came to be. My stupid ass literally thought for a second how are they gonna see this? Fear death. Save me from myself. I seem to notice a lot of people with their middle fingers out as they drive past me. I just smile and give them a little wave and think how funny it would be if they knew what they were saying. I know you're joking but when I studied ASL and HS in college people always thought they were hilarious when they would say I know sign language too. And flip me off. Ha 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 haven't heard that one in Czech's watch at least an hour. I'm not a sign language user. But giving the middle finger in Korean sign language means mountain because it comes from the shape of the Chinese character that means mountain. Before I started learning ASL I used to brush my hair away from my face in a way that kinda looked like the sign for horse, if I'm remembering correctly, which I'm sure confused a few people. Only tangentially related, but I have a deaf regular customer who will sign at me and or point, with the occasional note in a pinch. And some things are hilariously clear. She managed to communicate WTF. Did someone smoke a bowl up in here? It reeks of weed. With perfect clarity. No note required. In terms of rude signs, vagina. All the time. And oddly very frequently amongst YouTubers. It's madness. Michelle Obama was signing it on the cover of Reader's Digest a few years ago. Lesbian. 
It's when people pose putting a L-shaped hand to their chin for pictures. As a lesbian, it always makes me chuckle when someone texts me. Thinking face. Thinking face. Thinking face. A while back there was a little kids choir. Completely forgot why I saw it, and they were singing several songs mostly things like nursery rhymes, and would sign along to the lyrics. When they were singing Twinkle Twinkle Little Star they all simultaneously had been told to make the shape of a star instead of doing the actual sign. The star shapes turned out to be what's equivalent to a vagina. In sign language Lumeo, it's not like the instructor, who knew a bit of ASL, was able to explain what they were actually signing. They were literally preschoolers kindergartners. I know this dude that would absentmindedly hit the top of his fist with the bottom of the other. What he didn't know is that this is the sign for masturbate. I'm not fluent in sign language but I've been teaching certain signs to my 15 month old. Learning as we go, I see the sign for all done every day. The most common one I see people do inadvertently is there and here. I think because it's so common to just point in something and say it's over there. People do I love you when trying to do rock on a lot. A lot of people trying to indicate numbers but not realizing that ASL the numbers are done differently or when people sign finished when they're just taking and using their hands when they speak. Note, not deaf and I am Italian so I do use my hands when speaking but since learning ASL I'm more aware of how I use my hands in certain situations ha ha. Whoa, you made it to the end? You're a ducking beast. I'll cut you a deal. Smash like and subscribe for more curated content bruh. It's free and that's a great price.